shot at sight. But the failure to see that the equality of women has to be an absolute and non-negotiable part of the revolutionary process and not just a post-revolution promise alienated many progressive women and pushed them in great numbers towards liberal activism. The liberal feminist movement and the Dalit movement have become heavily NGOized. Many of these NGOs have done very good work on gender, on sex work, on homosexuality, on health, on AIDS, and all of this. But as long as their work doesn't actually challenge the economic structures of the neoliberal empire, the money will keep coming. So, so you see that people who are official feminists, you know, the official feminist groups will always keep their distance from radical feminist issues like displacement, you know, where women suffer the most. Why, why, are not, why are they not there with the Narmada protests or with the protests in Chhattisgarh? Because NGO funding doesn't allow that to be part of the agenda. Now at a time when capitalism is going through such a serious crisis, it's important for the left to show a new and more flexible and inclusive imagination.